Hi, I'm Max Dalton, and in this video, I'm going to talk through how to set up Plex Cloud with Google Drive. Plex has recently added the ability for users to set up a Plex Cloud server. Users can connect either a Google Drive, Dropbox, or OneDrive account to their cloud server, select content from their chosen cloud provider to make available through the cloud server, and then stream that content directly from their cloud storage provider through Plex. The solution makes it even easier for end users to make Plex the primary interface for accessing all of their music, movies, and photos. This video outlines the process for connecting your Plex cloud server to your Google Drive account. And now the process for connecting Google Drive to Plex cloud. Step 1. Log in to the Plex Media Server application on the machine operating as your server. Step 2. Click the drop down to the right of your account icon in the upper right corner of the screen. Step 3. Click Account. Your account page opens. Step 4. Click Plex Cloud in the list of options along the left side of the screen. Step 5. Click Link to the right of Google Drive in the list of available cloud providers. You can also connect to Microsoft OneDrive or Dropbox. But these instructions are focused on connecting Google Drive to your Plex Cloud. Log in to your Google account if prompted. A general access screen appears asking if Plex Cloud can view and manage the files in your Google Drive, view your email address, and view your basic profile information. Click Allow. You'll receive a prompt to log in to your Plex account. Log in to your Plex account. A message will appear that your Plex Cloud is connected and ready to go. Click Continue. You'll be returned to your Plex Media Server home screen, where you'll notice Plex Cloud is the current server you're viewing information for in the upper left corner. At this point, you've successfully connected Google Drive to your Plex Cloud account. And now the process for adding Google Drive content to Plex Cloud. Step 1. Log in to Plex Media Server and change the server name in the upper left corner of the screen to be Plex Cloud. If you haven't previously selected any of your OneDrive content to be added to Plex Cloud, you'll see an orange Add Library button on the right side of the window, where your content would typically be displayed. Step 2. Click Add Content. The Add Library window appears. Step 3. Choose Select Type on the left side of the screen if it isn't selected by default. Step 4. Select the icon associated with the type of content you want to add. Your options are movies, TV shows, music, photos, or other videos. Assign a name to the content library you're adding in the name field, and then click Next to move to the Add Folders section. Click Browser for Media Folder. The text Google Drive appears on the left side of the window, and all of the high-level folders in your connected Google Drive account appear on the right side of the window. Step 7. Select the folder you want to add. Keep drilling through any necessary subfolders until you arrive at the specific folder you want to add. You can only add one folder at a time. Click Add. You're returned to the Add Library window that shows the path to the folder you selected to add content from. Step 9. Click the orange Add Library button. You'll be taken back to the Plex Media Server home screen, where a message appears on the right side of the screen that says libraries are currently being updated. Eventually, you'll see thumbnails associated with the content in the folder you elected to add start populating on the right side of the screen. Now, the steps to unlink Google Drive from Plex Cloud. Unlinking Google Drive from your Plex Cloud server makes it possible for you to connect Plex Cloud to another cloud storage provider, such as Microsoft OneDrive or Dropbox. You can unlink your Plex Cloud server from OneDrive by doing the following. Step 1. Navigate back to the Plex Cloud window on your account screen. Step 2. Click Unlink to the right of Google Drive. A message appears telling you that you'll no longer be able to access Google Drive content in Plex Cloud. Step 3. Click the red 
unlink button.